20% would be invested in a way which banks on the fact that the world will never be the same again. And so I split that 50-50. So I put some into the old-fashioned way of hedging against some sort of financial Armageddon. That's gold, physical precious okay. metals, yep. and paper gold like GLD, which is oh, an ETF. So gold is not dead. Gold is not dead. Okay. So again, I'm going to offend everybody who's hardcore Bitcoin maxi. I know I already offend the, the gold bugs. That's easy. <laughs> and I offend all the traditional mainstream financial advisors because I'm even talking about this. So everybody hates me, but I think it makes sense because if the new world is fundamentally different from the old world, then it's probably going to be a analog world or a digital world, if I was to guess, right? Like if the great experiment or the great transformation that's happening right now goes exceedingly well, then Bitcoin to the moon, as far as I'm concerned. Because if the whole world is going digital, then surely you want to get some digital asset to go with you 